Have you guys ever felt cluttered? You felt like you couldn't breathe? You felt like it was just too much stuff? Too many things? Just a lot of stuff going on in your life? That's because mainly you got too much in your life. You got too many things that don't matter. You got a lot of clutter. And uh, I don't know if you guys are like me, but I like to keep things organized. But sometimes, you know, in the uh, midst of living life, uh, everyday living, everyday struggles, just living your life, sometimes things do get a little cluttered. You don't have time to organize things. You're on the go all the time and things start to build up. Well... You got to clean up. You can take my garage, for example. Um, it's very cluttered in here. As you can see, uh, if I wanted to get my four-wheeler out of here, I'll have to move all of this out of the way. Um, you know, if I wanted to get in my car here, I, have to, I don't drive it anyway. But if I wanted to get in it, I have to move all this stuff out the way. And it's just in my way, you know. Uh, if you come in here, check out my uh, storage room. It's really small room. I mean, I got it packed with all kind of stuff. You know, I got my pressure washer that I use for my car washing. You know, you see my vac over here. And I, you know, I got ladders and stuff in here. And it could be a whole lot more organized. And there's a lot of stuff in here that are broken and I don't need them that I could just simply throw away. And, but sometimes we hold on to things that we don't need. We hold on to things that we don't need in life because we're looking for validation. And we're, you know, we're looking for that validation. And, and uh, I mean, it really doesn't matter. Like no one, no one really can validate you. Um, sometimes, you know, it, is, it, it does feel good to get validation from someone, but you have to validate yourself anyways. But, you know, I'm going to clean up in there uh, these next couple of weeks because it's been doing a lot of rain. It's going to be really slow. I'm going to have jobs here and there. So in between jobs, I'm going to be cleaning out my garage and just getting rid of all the clutter. And sometimes we got to do the same thing in our lives. You know, we all have those friends. We all have those family members that pull us down. And they, you know, sometimes they pull us down by being negative, being je jealousy, envies. You got your haters and everything. And uh, get rid of those type of people. Get them out of their life. Just like I got to get rid of all, a lot of that stuff in my garage and clear up, that, clear up all that clutter so I can move around. So I can be able to get in and out of things. Uh, same thing in life. You know, you have to remove the clutter. Remove those fake friends. Remove those jealous friends. Remove those people that don't, don't they just, they, they can't help you at all. There's no reason to have them in your life. I'm pretty sure you can look through your cell phone and you got about 20 or 30 contacts that you do not need. Uh, as my friend Don Fawcett says, you got about 20 or 30 contacts you don't need. You look at your fr Facebook friends, you know, over half those people you don't even know. So, you know, you just... You know, you're just filling up space that can be used for something more important. So